Hey, today we're hanging out in Hill City with Rudy, the owner of Elizabeth Coffee Company. And Elizabeth is your daughter. She is. Yes. This coffee company is named after her. So talk a little bit about what you have going on here downtown Hill City. I am originally from Northern Minnesota. Both my husband and I are. I came out here in 2013 and went to school at Western Dakota Tech in Rapid City. And by the time I was graduating from college, I was nine months pregnant with Elizabeth and stayed. We just opened up a coffee shop on January 5th. So we've been open a few weeks. We've got areas for people to come in and just grab things and go if they would like to, or sit and visit and hang out. And Or if somebody needs to come in with you know their work or a laptop, we've got internet available. They can sit and get a coffee and do what they need to do for the day. We have many different drinks and things offered, smoothies and energy drinks, along with the coffee and tea and those types of things. A lot of different flavors. It shocked me how many flavors you could actually get together for coffee, for sure. The coffee is actually locally roasted here in Hill City by Dry Creek Coffee, which I own that business as well. I have owned that since 2013. And so this is kind of just an expansion of that business. We're selling and serving our coffee. We have Italian sodas, we have green tea, we have different flavored teas, blacks, greens, fruity teas, all of those things, and all of the different coffees from blended or iced or hot, whatever somebody would like. This is all of our merchandise over here. So we have the coffee for sale, ground coffee for sale. We have t-shirts and hats and cups. And then we also have bulk coffee if people would like to purchase just the beans or grind it themselves. And I love what you said that a lot of this stuff, the furnishings in here are local. Yes, yeah, so actually Elizabeth's Grandpa John, he made all of the tables. He got the live edge pieces and then finished the tops of the two tall bar top tables and the two shorter tables, he actually cut them down the center and then flipped them and put a river pour down the center with different things down the center of both of them. We have some small food items. We have a couple of breakfast things like a ham and cheese croissant or a breakfast burrito or a fruit parfait. And then we of course have the sweet things, cinnamon rolls, caramel rolls, scones, cookies, muffins, and rotating flavors. Now what does Elizabeth have to say about her own coffee shop? She really, really loves it. She is definitely the boss around here. We all joke that when she comes in, it says, oh, the big boss is here today. But she loves it. She does a lot of running the cash register. And of course, she's still in school, so she only gets to be here on the weekends. But she is here as often as possible. We are open Thursday through Monday from 6 to 2. We'll expand that as we get to summer hours. And we don't have a website at the time, but we do have Facebook under Elizabeth's Coffee Company. <laughs> yeah, come check us out. Please do. We would love to meet you and have a cup of coffee and visit. We love to get to know everybody.